The high to our east will let the heat be pushed back across more of Victoria tomorrow. And northerly winds will keep it there on Wednesday, ahead of a milder change that comes in with the trough. Now these winds have kicked up dust over South Australia and this is expected in the Mallee tomorrow. So it's smoke haze and raised dust. And severe fire danger there. The Mallee has a total fire ban for Tuesday. There may be another one on Wednesday as well. Thursday brings a little wet weather. This is mainly in the southwest and it clears out during the afternoon. Then it's looking like better rain on Saturday. This could produce 10 millimetres from the southwest up to the northeast, and that does include Melbourne as well. And it turns to snow up in the Alps. Around the nation tomorrow, mild in Perth but still hot in Adelaide. Sydney, it's a milder top of 24. Brisbane is 30. The Gold Coast, it's a dry and sunny morning. And showers are possible in the afternoon and evening. They could bring a few millimetres. To Victoria, we've got high cloud moving through. It is generally dry underneath. There is the slight risk of a storm that would bring little, if any, rain. It is warm to hot ahead of a milder change behind the trough that comes into the southwest. Closer inland, we will have high cloud overhead tomorrow. It's thickest over northern suburbs. There's that slight chance of a thundery shower, but expect no rain. Northerly winds are certainly making it very warm. The city will start on 16 and it rises to 29. It could go to 30 degrees tomorrow. High cloud overhead, but it is dry. To the eight-day outlook. Now, Wednesday, that's a tricky one. Expect heat as we have those northerly winds, 28, possibly even hotter. Then a cool change will come through during the afternoon, but it stays dry. Thursday, there's a slight chance of a shower during the morning, back down to about 24. We rise up on Friday, lots of sunshine. It is dry. And Saturday, that is the cold and wet one. We could see 10 millimetres in these showers more early next week. So high cloud tomorrow, northerly winds, let the temperature soar. It could be another 30, which 